Okay. Should just be two more and that's it. Okay. So here it is white to move. Looks like the bat black king can just take all of them, but that's not the case here. White's move, white's trying to promote on this ring. Or one of these squares, right? Okay. That's the first move, okay? Any other moves would end up being a loss for white. Black will take. Now, do you take back with your pawn? No. G6. Okay. And once H6 take back, now, do you push the pawn or do you take the pawn? Well, if you said take the pawn, eh, it's not a good move. You don't believe me? Let's see what happens when you take the pawn. King comes up here. You think you're going to score a touchdown or make the goal. The king catches you just on time. That's the problem. Okay, so after pawn takes, push. King can't catch you now. Look at that. White wins the game. Okay. Last position here. Okay. So let's see how we win this. Take a guess. Pause your video if you need to. But let's see what the answer is. We're going to first go with the incorrect answers, okay? Someone might want to try F6. Well, this would be incorrect. Let's just say black decides to push g6. White takes, black takes. Now white kings get run over. But does not look like white's going to be able to stop anything. Now black has two extra pawns. Check. Okay, moves over so he can bring his other pawn into the game. Check. Willing to sacrifice a pawn if white king takes f5. This one here. This one runs down. So he moves back. Doesn't look like white has much of a chance here. Okay. Okay, so what if it has to be h6, right? Some of you are thinking, well, it has to be h6. Because it's the furthest away. Incorrect. It's just like f6. Pushes, takes, takes. And we got, we're going to have the same thing happen like when we push the other one. So here, what you want to do is, you see the three pawns are lined up exactly. There's not, there's not a fourth pawn here hanging off to this side, okay? They're exactly lined up to one another, right? It's kind of like a regular chess game. We both have eight pawns, and when you start your chess game in the opening, what's the thing you control? The center. So the correct move here to win this little mini chess corner here is to play for the center since they're all lined up equally. So G6, this wins the game. Now, let's say black takes the F way, right? With F pawn. Now you're going to see, oh, which way is which. Now this pawn can just go straight up, but there's a problem. There's another pawn here, right? So, we're going to attack the pawn. Now we have two different ways of winning. If G takes, then we push, right? But what about G takes the other way? Then we take this way. Okay. So, 
this is what happens when f takes g and if you think about it with this move here if h would have took g instead it would be the same thing but the exact opposite okay so 